Below Deck Season 11 is in full swing and some cast members might not return due to their performance this season. In this video, we will explore the Below Deck Season 11 cast, and where are they now? The season is filled with drama as it unfolds. Kyle Stilley and Barbie Pasquale recently hooked up, and new chef Nick Tatlock joined to replace Chef Anthony Iracane. Ben Willoughby's issues with Camille Lamb caused problems with Sonny Marquis, leading to their breakup. Chef Nick has failed to impress Captain Carey, and Ben confronted Barbie about her fling with Kyle. Overall, the cast is a mess, and some members are likely not to return. Captain Carey Captain Carey Titheridge has been actively steering the course since taking over in Below Deck Season 11. He succeeded the franchise's veteran captain, Lee Rosbach, who stepped down after a decade, likely due to health concerns. Transitioning from Below Deck Adventure, Captain Carey faced uncertainty about his reception, but he quickly proved his mettle. Throughout his inaugural charter season on the main series, he demonstrated adept leadership alongside Chief Stu Fraser Olander, only letting go of two crew members. Captain Carey efficiently managed conflicts, notably firing Jared Wooden early in the season due to poor performance as bosun. While he earned the respect of most of his crew, tensions arose with Ben Willoughby. After promoting Ben to bosun following Jared's departure, the two frequently clashed, with Ben accusing Captain Carey of micromanagement as the season drew to a close. Despite these challenges, there are strong rumors that Captain Carey will return for Below Deck Season 12, possibly joined by another Season 11 alum, signaling his readiness for another stint at the helm. Sonny Marcus Sonny serves as lead deckhand on St. David after getting promoted this season by Ben Willoughby. And while the deckhand is pretty good at her job, she might not want to return, given the current drama unfolding with Ben. Despite having over a year of yachting experience, the deckhand might want to leave the cameras behind because of Ben and the love triangle on board. Ben undoubtedly created a stir by ending his casual relationship with Sonny to pursue his ex, Camille, who starred in Below Deck Season 10. Ben admitted to feeling a spark with her that he hadn't experienced with Sonny and posted about Camille on social media before breaking the news to Sonny. The lead deckhand was understandably upset, and instead of talking things through, Ben decided to end things with Sonny. Hopefully, Sonny moves past this and returns to the show, but it might be too much for the new cast member, Dylan De Villiers. Dylan De Villiers' drama has been rampant throughout the season, but his latest encounter might be a step too far for him to get invited back for subsequent seasons of Below Deck. Dylan admitted to hooking up with a guest, and while flirtation and hookups with guests have occurred across various seasons and spin-offs of the franchise, most notably with Kyle Viljoen, it's against the rules. Captain Carey likes to run a tight ship and maintain professionalism, and engaging in romantic activity with a guest goes against his values. Dylan's past behavior of fanning the flames of drama through the season and hooking up with a guest suggests that he may not return to Below Deck in the future, especially given the show's emphasis on maintaining professionalism and avoiding romantic entanglements with guests. However, he's a step up from Jared Wooden, whom he replaced after the original bosun's firing. Kyle Stilley Kyle had the opposite problem of many Below Deck cast members. He didn't bring enough to the show. Arguably, the most interesting thing Kyle has done in Below Deck Season 11 is hook up with Barbie, who is now torn between her feelings for Kyle and her obligation toward her family, especially her father. The stew was initially hesitant due to her aversion to boatmances, but the pair finally hooked up in Season 11, Episode 13. As Barbie and Kyle's friendship and flirtation deepened, Kyle became a more prominent figure in the show. The undeniable chemistry between them suggests that their attraction may lead to further developments, including a dramatic conversation between Ben and Barbie regarding their hookup. While Kyle is at the center of a current onboard drama, he remains a relatively uninteresting character in his own regard in the show. It wouldn't be surprising if he weren't invited back. Chef Anthony Ira Kane. During Below Deck Season 11, Captain Carey fired Chef Anthony due to concerns about his performance, especially after receiving a low tip from some guests. Despite acknowledging Anthony's culinary skills, Captain Carey felt he was going south fast and not rising to the occasion. Anthony, taken aback by the decision, claimed it was his first time being fired and struggled to process it. Captain Carey explained that he made the decision for the team's morale as the crew had started to notice Anthony's performance issues. Despite the crew's sadness over Anthony's departure, the firing seemed unfair. Past seasons showed crew members assisting chefs during dinner service, which could have made a difference for Chef Anthony. There have undoubtedly been way worse chefs on below deck. However, it's unlikely he will ever return, given his firing. Barbie Pasquale Aside from her boatmance with Kyle, Barbie might be driven to quit before the end of the charter. Barbie has found it challenging to fit in with the crew, especially Fraser. 
Tensions between Barbie and Fraser have reached a fever pitch, with Zandi playing into their feud. Despite Barbie's strong work ethic, Fraser has been vocal about disliking the stew. Their personalities clash, and despite efforts to resolve their differences, they struggle to find common ground. The situation worsened when Catbaugh left the crew. With the workload increasing and the absence of Cat, tensions heightened. Fraser and Zandi continued to gang up on Barbie, making her feel isolated and ready to quit. Despite the challenges, Barbie has proven herself to be a hardworking stew. Despite this, Fraser continues to accuse Barbie of insubordination. While her latest struggles involved whether to engage in a boatmance with Barbie, it seems her first season will be her last. She can also run home to her wealthy father and doesn't need to keep this job, Catbaw. Unlike crew members who were fired, Cat chose to leave the St. David of her own accord. Cat struggled with adjusting to her role on the yacht due to emotional trauma stemming from her past. She revealed to Chief Stu Fraser Olander that she had been in foster care as a teenager after her parents passed away, which led to her being separated from her biological brother. Cat's emotional struggles affected her performance on the boat as she struggled with housekeeping and dinner service tasks. Despite Fraser and Zandi's efforts to train her, Cat seemed unhappy and disconnected from the rest of the crew. In what almost seemed like an excuse, Cat received a call from a friend dealing with a serious personal issue back home. Understanding the situation's urgency, Cat expressed her need to leave immediately. Captain Carey prioritized Cat's mental health and arranged for her to leave the boat. Given her lack of adjustment to life on the yacht, it's unlikely Cat will return. Jared Wooden. Jared may have brought over a decade of experience to below deck season 11, but Captain Carey still unceremoniously fired him. Unfortunately for Jared, his time on the show took an unexpected turn when he was dismissed following a heated interaction with deckhand Kyle Stilley near the hot tub. Prioritizing the yacht's conduct standards, Captain Carey swiftly made the decision, meaning Jared had barely begun his tenure on the boat. Fired cast members tend to have a poor trajectory for returning to below deck for future seasons. Furthermore, Captain Lee shared he would have fired Jared earlier than Captain Carey did, noting that Jared's issues had been ongoing throughout the season. The episode featuring Jared's firing was particularly memorable, as it highlighted his custody issues and struggles to meet the yacht's high expectations. It also clearly painted a picture of why he won't be returning, Ben Willoughby. There are plenty of signs Ben might finally get fired on Below Deck Season 11. However, he's one of the problematic crew members still holding on for dear life. His relationship with Sonny caused continuous drama between his flirting with Paris and Zandi and his ditching of the deckhand to reconnect with his ex, Camille. He previously appeared in Season 10, where he engaged in a boatmance with Camille, causing crew tensions. Now, he seems poised to repeat his same mistakes. Despite his experience, Ben's disrespectful and unreliable conduct raises doubts about his suitability as a deckhand. Whether he gets fired or quits remains to be seen, but the Below Deck Season 11 cast member is hanging on by a thread. So that's it for today's video. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this one. Thanks for watching.